track the escape pods. Negative! Look out! This is not the way to travel in space. This time, stay inside. This is Ison Quinn, and with another episode of Gaming for Other Five Dollars, uh, this time it's Halo Four on the Xbox One. Uh, actually, Halo Four is part of a pack uh, that is the Master Chief Collection, but you can find it used for under five dollars. It's been it out seems for a like while. old times. Ready to get back to Let's work? Quick time to talk. I thought you'd never ask. Run by Windows Ten. We've got intrusion alerts lighting up on multiple jacks. Our best bet to figure out who's boarding us is the observation well, deck, four floors up. Could it be a rescue team? Wouldn't bet on it. Doubt it. Yes. Uh, so if you're looking for a great shooter on Xbox One, low price, fun to play, and, and actually you don't get Halo 4, you get Halo 1, 2, 3, 4, some bonus material. Uh, it's a really, really good deal. Even if you have to pay more than $5, it, it's it's a good deal. I'm doing 4 because I think it's the one that resed up the best and translated the best to the new console. It was released on the 360. So I'm sure a number of you have Four played years, it. 4 years, 7 months, 10 days. Somebody should have found us by now. Okay, you guys talk. So, uh, it, even if you played What's it on the that? 360, it's worth going back That's on the Xbox High intensity. And, Doesn't and match any known patterns. How close are we to the observation deck? It's directly above us. I'm not sure why she's yelling. So, uh, yeah, you know, if you're new to the Xbox, this would be a good game to pick up, just not at full price, uh, because you can get it used. Uh, and they're allowing you to play it used. So it's not backwards compatible. <laughs> that would be nice. But uh, even the Master Chief Collection, it's a great the collection. Elevator you can doors what tight. you want to play, scenes, a lot of benefits to it. But I'm just going to focus on this game, which is a, a great shooter, as we've come to expect from the Halo game. Chief, be Power careful! Oh. Because some areas might have lost pressure. Right. No pressure problem. Let's see if we can climb up. Up. Right. Left. Uh, Chief, watch coming. out! Yep. Up. Here's coming. I didn't realize the ship had deteriorated so badly. It didn't come I don't know where to go here. Oh, did that work? Okay. Up here. Up. Didn't come here. Hey. So at least it's a floor. Oh, hello. Beat up. I thought we had a truce with the Covenant. See you later. A lot can happen in four years. Yeah, totally. Either way, he's probably not alone. We should be careful. A lot can happen. They can take Halo 4 and up it to Xbox One and put it in a new package and then sell it for the $5. Let's see, who do we have to kill in here? You know, I originally thought I'd hide, see if I could make friends with him, but the objective is to kill him. So, let's see if I can just see. Okay, that's not how you make it, but apparently that's how you zoom in. It's been a while, I don't remember the controls. And if you're new to uh, Halo and wondering why the controls are the way they are, uh, they're they're grandfathered in from the original Xbox, and and once you get used to them, the controls make sense. And I do think developers like to have their own controls to differentiate them at the same time. But this one is, I think, mostly grandfathered. But they they work. Uh, it's a left bumper for running instead of holding the, the L sticks or right sticks. Which I'm thankful for because I can never hold them down well and run. Because I can't shoot. Either, so that's why I play shooters. I guess it's it's therapeutic. The guy running away from me, shoot him in the back. Now I feel bad for him. Okay. Who's over here? That's the last of them. Yep. Find the override for the blast so shield so we can see what we're up against. Uh, blast shields. I've seen too many movies where you don't open the blast shields, but you know, I'm sure something good will come of this. 
So while we're looking for the blast shields here, let me take the opportunity to remind you this is Ice and Quinn with EEO Studio. And if you have not subscribed on YouTube or Twitch, please, you know, follow or subscribe and like the videos. If you like the videos, you want to see more of them, it's appreciated. Uh, that's sort of how I guess the system works. Currency, so to speak. So, the good uh, news is these thanks for watching aren't outfitted like standard military. It's possible we just came across a rogue salvage ship. Don't think so. Or we might have stumbled into an entire Covenant fleet. Maybe they no haven't recognized us. Oh, Clint Eastwood there. That, that's... that's one possibility. Landing craft flanking us. <laughs> Losing my, my voice, otherwise I would try my... Yes. Well, let's, let's reach you. Departures in the white zone. Or I guess the blue zone, where their blood is. Here, have some grenades, because I've got a bunch up here. Off we go. I, I do like the, the shooters. When you can't kill them, you throw a grenade. <laughs> it's always the... The fix. Typically, if I'm playing a, a strategy shooter uh, against real people, I'll throw the grenade toward one side of the cover, and then I'll move to the other side of the cover and shoot them. Through. Not because I'm a good shot, because they line up. Oh, my shields. I forgot about the shield regeneration in this game. So I've got to find a place to recharge. Excuse me, guys. Just let me sit up here and recharge. It does recharge a lot faster. I guess Master Chief did get an upgrade. Is okay, down. You're dead. Someone forgot to talk. So I guess they flanked us, meaning they came in from both sides of the, the ship. That's not really flanking. It's just boarding in predictable locations. Okay, you guys. To chill out. Too much caffeine this morning, and you're just running around complaining. I, I don't understand where they're saying. This ship. We've got bigger yes. problems. We've got a cruiser on an intercept course. Head for the elevator banks. Uh, Did the ship sensors Heading say we early... still had weapon systems online? Yes, but since the ship was torn in half, we can't access the weapons. Very stations. bad idea. We'll have to fire them manually from the outer hull. And Cortana has an update coming in right now because there's the latest uh, service patch, the service pack for Windows 10. So I, maybe she's on Windows 100. I'm, I'm not sure. Uh, and the Cortana on Windows 10 does not look like the Cortana of this game. If you haven't upgraded to Windows 10 and are using Cortana. Uh, well, here's how you can tell this used to be a last generation game. Elevators were always used as loading screens. They can put you in it, make you think you're traveling, because you really don't need to travel this long in an elevator in a video game. It's because they're actually loading. And they did say loading there, to let you know. But that, that's all the elevator's for, is really. I mean, it moves you from room to room, but it's actually a loading screen. There were a lot of tricks at the last console too, because of the lack of memory in order to load sc screens without sh you know having loading in a black screen. Instead, you get loading with an elevator that shakes. All they do is shudder. Hello, guys. Ooh, hot gun. Yeah. So, I never said I was a good shot. Shoot a lot. Yeah, apparently I have to see them. Oh, they got a new gun. I hear you. Again. Yeah, hot gun. 
reload overheat. That cruiser's shields are down. Assuming they don't raise them, that missile's gonna be one heck of a surprise. Why would the shields be down? I guess because they're planning on boarding with a cruiser. Guess what? Let's do. Let's take a, a very large ship in the temple board. Okay. Oh, this guy's coming in with sparklers. No time for the 5th of July. Oh, <laughs> the grenades. <laughs> Okay, hopefully you guys learn from that. Don't run with two hot grenades in any chance. Because it's not going to work out well for you. Maybe you should put that one in the Covenant Training School. Maybe it looks cool. I, I thought he had sparklers. I thought they were coming to celebrate. It turns out. That's what it turns out he was just coming to kill himself. Oh, another sparkler guy. Oh, yeah. It's a shame more of them weren't alive, but I, I killed him. He's probably killed all of his other friends already with grenades. Well, actually, I assume he has no friends if you walk around like that. So you want to stand clear, if possible. And for those watching who have not played Halo 4, I'm only doing the opening of Halo 4. It's not going to spoil really much of These anything from one, two, or three, the ones we fought before. or much of four. This is really just the opening. Just wanted to do enough so you get a feel that this is a good shooter. You can use cover and tactics. Uh, and they throw some good surprises at you. You, know, you get overwhelmed sometimes, you have to sneak around. And wow, these guys are hot. Have one back. I'm gonna try and take out the small guys first, because that way they don't overwhelm me. Small firepower. He's got super armor on. Oh, and the Spartan shielders. Let's get rid of this guy again. Let's go back. Hello. This is you know, a, a nod. The ancient Greeks, the Spartans, used to use those shields, and the little curve that you shoot them through uh, actually is where the pikes would go, so they could put up a shield wall and present their pikes to oncoming cavalry, which was the tank from the day. And I know you're all saying, "Wow, that's what I needed to know in Halo 4," but it, I, I think it's a nice nod to history and where they they got their name. Although the Spartans. If you watch other videos, How far did the we're not quite as friendly as We're just John. about there. They were raised for combat. That's what they did. And they loved them. 300 might be a little bit overkill. It's not a gold sword. Yeah. A smaller aperture with a weapon point of view would work better. You guys have the technology. You can actually push through a window. You over there, I'm ignoring you guys on the right. Just ignore me. These guys are hot looking at uh, Maybe the guys on the right don't understand. They're not supposed to be involved yet. So make it clear. I'll be back. Rid of these guys. Can someone come out with two sparklers. Hold it in there. Stay inside that room. I gotta get rid of the bunny here. But what I'm gonna do is walk around the outside of that room, killing everything. And then you can wonder what I'm gonna do when I come in the room. Yeah, stay in there and complain. Weapon. Another weapon. There's guys in the room I have to kill. Oh. Spartan gold shield. Easy. Guys, actually, are shooting. Out. Yeah, some, some are shooting. Out. I'm about to lose my shield. Okay, so I promise you, I'll be back. No, I am. Oh, well, I hear somebody. Who are you talking? Are you on the radio? Ah, oh, that's a. 
bird or, or a deer. Can't tell the difference between clear glass and clear opening. Who just are you are you talking to me? I can't understand you. So just be quiet. Oh. Or whoever you're talking to, if they're not listening because they're not coming. Now they can't hear you at all. So it would behoove John to uh, our Spartan to learn their language because well, you could accomplish a lot if you knew what these guys were yelling. Maybe they're saying, move to the left, or I've got them in this corner, or hurry up, set off the you know, special bomb that's going to kill everyone. It, it, you never know. Or Cortana could subtitle it. I don't remember, but I thought there were some secret areas in uh, the Halo games. I'm not sure. So if I'm wrong, sorry. Uh, I play a lot of video games, so it's hard to remember. And I, it's been a while since I've played a Halo game, to be quite honest. I Now that I'm playing it, I, I wish I hadn't taken so long. Cause this one, I did skim through the others. This one does have the best look. All of them do have good graphics, strong upgrade graphics. This one seems to have the best movement, best best graphics. I, I think it works the best as passing off as a next gen uh, video game because it was late in the cycle for the Xbox. So if you want to take this opportunity to jab that like button, go ahead or subscribe or follow. You can also catch me on Twitter as Rudolph the Pierce. All the information should, should be online. Out of the airlocks. You'll have to prime okay. the launch for ignition. I, Cortana. I will. It's nothing. Just get to the launch station. Well, uh, speaking of I'm Windows sorry, glitches, did I miss orbiting a Forerunner planet at some point? Yeah. One thing at a time. Cortana's got it right. Talk. Uh, what happened was apparently I was bumped off of uh, Xbox Live and the message came up and halted the game. You can play offline, but apparently I didn't realize that it will halt the game if you lose your connection to Xbox Live. Uh, so that's something to know. You can play offline. Not, it's not like, you know, like originally Microsoft originally said that you have to play online all the time. But it is interesting it halts the game once you know and asks you to reestablish your connection. I'm not sure if we're doing need boards, but uh, it really Chief, you need to the find game. the missile controls. But needs to say, I had the pause cut out all my login information as much as I can be sure. These snipers are going to be a problem. I don't want to die 50 times. some frame rate drops. This is on my primary drive. I've downloaded it, so I don't think it is. It's on my primary drive, but occasionally I'll get uh, a jump, a little frame rate uh, drop. Not bad, just, just once or twice. Uh, so if you've noticed also, uh, it's not been enough to hinder the game. In the other games, I've played through. Showcase here. Yeah. Hit that guy up there. Not much. No. Okay, it's arcing short. So we have to go around the fly. Well, simple enough solution. We just have to kill everyone.
I, I do tend to find even for the change because a lot of people tend to improve the times. That's where you'll catch the other players from doing other things. Well, basically, uh, run away. In, in you know, tactical combat, things not protecting you from going down. As I think these guys are demonstrating, they don't seem to have much on their minds. In a straight line. Now in my defense, uh, well I could cut it out, but <laughs> does it really start me from the checkpoint? In my defense, uh, if I were actually hey, engaged in combat, I would know how the to swing won't fire uh, melee until it's weapon. Clear. Get down there. Moment, I to figure out what weapon it was. But, games are games, you have to learn. Lots of people complain, hello, uh, you know, about being stuck on terrain and, and controls. It happens. It's one thing you have to learn if you're going to play the game. I paid the price, and you, the viewers, are now paying the price by watching me go back. But now I'm on a rampage. I know the melee button is beat. Okay. We'll probably zoom in for more time. Zoom is our three. I have a loaded weapon, which helps. Weapon right there. Yeah. See, I have a melee button this time. I've got a weapon. I can't hit. But <laughs> that doesn't stop me. Still gonna shoot until I'm out of ammo. Weapon, heavy weapon someplace. Every dead person drops over. So, that's a weapon, also. Weapon. Ah, look, you're dead again. I've got another weapon. Like you guys, I'm not sitting around with lots of weapons. Oh. Two weapons. The Covenant is doomed. Spark with two weapons. There's not this anymore. to fight. Let's fight. Yeah, I have on this weapon. I can act like I have lots of ammo. There 
Remember, I know the melee button. <laughs> Great to use. I'm a Spartan in power armor. Who's just lost his shield and so looking for a place to hide. No, still no ammo. Well, look, I've got a big gun. Stand back, I'll shoot. I've got a small gun. Stand back, I'll shoot. I'm deadly, I'm a Spartan. I've got a gun. I'm just gonna pummel the daylights out of you. Yep. Now you've got an angry Spartan. doesn't work, but this fist does. Well, we have to thank the Earth Forces for giving us power armor. Because I can pistol slap my way through the cup. Dead? I guess he's dead. Well, let's get to the objective. What is this? Is it stuck? I can't. It's, it's kind of sense. Yeah, it looks like it's a device. Oh, now I've got ammo. Excellent. I can shoot it. I don't know what this device is doing, but I'll, I'll do whatever it wants me to here. I'm going to push it. We did it. Get back. Kick it in a strange style, and I don't want to be near this thing when it goes up, and it looks like we're locked in here. Read Larry Niven's uh, Ring World if you want some more inspiration. That guy is going to be a problem, I can tell. You don't blow up cruisers inside ships. I don't know either. Covered by the one scanning us. Yeah, I don't know who's scanning us. So now, can we worry about the giant now, metal planet? The doors are open. I've got a loaded gun, though. He's using a gravity well to pull so. us inside the Well, surface. I know what happens from here. We've got to hurry. The second we cross it's the not good. Horizon, so, uh, well, thanks for uh, uh, watching. Uh, again, this is Ice and Quinn on, on YouTube. Oh, Ask duck me. that. Okay. Get over here. I'm tagging the closest airlock. Wrapping up early, I, I do have to get this objective. I thought it was going to fall apart, but it didn't. But I'll still say this is Ice and Kuna on YouTube. Remember to like or subscribe. I appreciate it. Or follow me on Twitter or watch me on Twitch. Or if, if you don't like what I'm doing, follow me and send me a complaint. That's fine, too. I listen to him. I'm stuck in a room here. Someone open the door. The ship's going down. There's one nice thing about Halo is the... The events that are critical, they're time-related, not really time-related. So you don't run out of time, typically. Can't go that way. Got the hit, fallen ceiling. So you can take a lot of time to get to the uh, objective. We're like an Assassin's Creed. When they're time, they're time, and we look around time. Start over. I'm, I'm not going to be able to platform this. I'm a, tit a, a Spartan, sorry, not a Titan, a Spartan. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have platformed it. Well, you give me a platform in a game, I assume you platform. Not that I'm good at it. It's just an assumption. I'm not going to platform this time, I don't think. Because there's no way around. Uh, like I said, the, the clock's ticking down theoretically, but we have all the time in the world that I know of. Because I, I've never rushed in any of in the, the Halo games. You, stop. I've got an empty gun. Yeah. Just pummeling you to the ground. I feel bad for you now, but thanks for the ammo. Yeah, I'm I'm pummeling dead people now. <laughs> or dead covenant members. Clear that. Whoa! Yep. Okay. Here's the room that I didn't want to be in. I even my even my super armor is not gonna stop this. I don't know why. I guess everything's gonna fall off. I'm not sure I can control it. It's, it feels like you have a little control and not. Either way, I know what's going to happen here. So thanks for watching. This is Isaac Quinn. I'll catch you next time when something large hits me in outer space. Until then, take it easy. Yeah.